Hello everybody, bringing you guys another review. This is Professor Fatman and today I am going to do a review on the Gold's Gym XR 6.1 weight bench from Walmart. Now I bought this uh, about two days ago. It was uh, 67 bucks I believe. So I just built it today and uh, it took me about what 15-20 minutes so it doesn't take that long. Now the bench does come with uh, all the items you're going to need to to build it such as screws and stuff like that but you're going to need a couple of uh, handy equipment to build this so let me go ahead and show you what you're going to need to build this chair. All right, first here it is. You're going to need this right here. It is a 9 by 16 let me go ahead and focus over here. Okay, so it's gonna be a nine by 16 pretty much. And there it is, it's the back side. That's one of the items you're gonna need. And here's the other. This one is a 11 by 16. There's that. You're gonna need one of these. And you're gonna need one of these. You're gonna need mostly this part right here. Don't try it with this or you're gonna have a pain. It's gonna be a pain building this thing if you try this side. So just stick with this. You're gonna need one of these. And these three items right here. All right, so let's get started with the chair. All right, so here it is, XR 6.1 Gold's Gym. Let me go ahead and show you the cushion. Cushion is not that thick, first of all. It's I mean, that's what you get when you pay six, seven bucks for a uh, weight bench. I mean, what do you expect to get? Don't expect no leather seats, you know? So there it is, cushion. Let me show you these, uh, these cushions right here. These are about an inch thick. I tried these, tried to do a little workout with these. Pretty comfortable, not bad. Now this back piece right here has a really hard plastic type right here. So if you're gonna do exercise right here, just make sure to let it go slowly. Cause if not, you're gonna hear like a bang. See? So just take it slow there so you don't make a dent over time. So I'm gonna be using this weight bench in the carpet and I'm gonna see how it works out. I'll keep you guys updated, updated on uh, how, how, how this bench is going and stuff like that so here it is it's got uh three settings so you could put your uh your bar it's got my guy on the middle one top one now four i'm sorry four settings and the the bar behind the the seat has three settings got it on the one all the way up top now that's the highest you're gonna go if you put it on the last one obviously it's gonna be flat and uh yeah, so I bought this bar right here, five foot, five foot bar, and uh, you, you can tell it's that bar is pretty big for the chair. So there's a grip part. There's a downside to this though, and I noticed that it's just too narrow. The bench is too narrow for for the bar. But uh, what you're gonna have to do is extend your arms a little more to the sides so you can do I guess your proper weights so you can uh, not have troubles when you when you try and bring the bar down is what I noticed you kind of have a little problem but I mean you gotta work with it now there are certain weight limits you can use on this weight bench let me go ahead and show you real quick it comes with a little booklet so here it is the you guys can go ahead and read that pause it if you guys want to take a look at it looking a little blurry sorry I'm using my phone camera broke so I'm gonna have to stick with this for now I'll go ahead and show you guys this, these uh, warnings you guys can check them out pause the video take a look at them see what, what this uh, bench has to offer that also comes as is weight bench exercise guidelines like a little idea of what you can do on this bench. Now, now what I noticed, the bench you use 
the XR 6.1 is not really this bench you see in the picture so there are some exercises that you're gonna see here that you won't be able to do due to the fact that this uh, bench lacks some of uh, some extra things to do some uh, exercises on this but for the most part you're gonna be able to do all these uh, most of them actually so that's that now the length from here to here I measured it already it's about two feet and what three inches so you have an idea of how long it is and uh, how small it is and uh, yeah so so there's your bench now I'm gonna put the in the description box the weight set that I bought on the side just to accompany this weight bench in the description box I'll be putting that so you guys can check it out see if you guys like it now I will also put the specs of this bench in the description box now if you guys have any questions or comments on this chair I mean I'm sorry on this weight bench go ahead and put them in the comment box and I'll go ahead and reply to the best of my knowledge on this bench and I will keep you guys updated on how this bench is working now so thank you guys for watching this is professor fat man go ahead and comment like and subscribe hello everybody I'm bringing you guys another review this is professor fat man and today I am going to do a review on the Gold's Gym XR 6.1 weight bench from Walmart. Now I bought this uh, about two days ago. It was uh, 67 bucks, I believe. So I just built it today and uh, it took me about, what, 15, 20 minutes. So it doesn't take that long. Now it, the bench does come with uh, all the items you're gonna need to, to build it, such as screws and stuff like that. But you're gonna need a couple uh, handy 